Hi everybody, Rosa here to show you my latest creation. This is an altered cigar box that I made for a swap at CCL, Creating the Crafty Life. Um, I decided to go with the Christmas theme on this box because uh, my partner did mention to me that she would like for it to be a Christmas theme. And here is the final result. And let me show you what I did. Now, the first thing I did it was that I painted the whole entire box white with like a white gesso. And then what I did was I actually covered it up with some paper, some Christmas themed paper, cardstock here, and around the, around the whole entire lid, the bottom part, and on the top part I used uh, green cardstock, and then I just put a, a embossed um, poinsettia cardstock on there. And then what I decided to do, I decided to add a little a Santa Claus, a uh, little stuffed animal on here, because uh, all the paper that I I, I used. Um, basically has a little Santa Claus on it so I decided to add that little Santa Claus on there and then I just added some regular uh, fabric poinsettias on here I put one on the corner here one over here and then I bought some this is like sparkle they were like sparkle poinsettias and what I did is I just cut off the um, the petals and it just used them as uh, embellished them as leaves around the poinsettias and then these are some little floral, flourish, floral flourishes that I use sticking out. They're the plastic kind. I got this actually from a Christmas ornament. What I did is I just cut out the little stems of the flourishes and then just added on there all the way around the whole entire um, box. And what I did also at the bottom, as you can see there, the little um, trim lace. This actually is a trim lace that I bought at Wild Orchid and Crafts and I just added on there. And then around the bottom here I used some... Regular trim here, some lace trim on here, and then I just added a decorative trim there, around there, and then I added another red trim here, and it's that same red trim, I put it all around the lid on the top part. And then here I added another point set. what I did is that instead of putting it as is, what I did is I took it out the stem and just put in the, the, the floral, or the the two parts of the poinsettia, I just put them on there, glued on there, and just put a little Wild Worker Craft uh, Summer Bloom on here, and then I just put a flat back pearl here with some of the pearl trim around it. And then here I used, uh, this is a wood chip a Christmas ornament, says Merry Christmas on there, I got this at Walgreens for like a dollar, and I just added on there, and I add, I actually took off the little um, decoration, this, this is what it brought, this little, uh, it's like, like an evergreen um, decoration that I had on here and what I did is I added some of this um, this it's, it's like a kind of like a tool kind of lace trim thing let me show you how it looks like I got it by the roll this is what I used for to put it on here and I just put I made it to like a little bow and put it on there and then just added a little sock button on there Christmas stocking button and then just added some little uh, I guess you could call this like little hollies on here, green hollies. And I just added some little stars all the way around and added some um, hat pins and some stick pins on here that I made and some around here. And uh, that's about it on the top part. Let me open it up. I did add some little bells on here, hangling on the lid. So when you open it up, uh, this is the paper that I used to cover the bottom part. Of the box and then I just added a gloss green um, ribbon on here so that way when she opens up the box it'll stay up upright instead of falling back because I know that these little boxes when you open it the lid will fall back and this is the the the, the lid sorry the inside of the lid and what I did is that I just added a little pocket on here and then I just added some some photo mats and, and a mat on here that says family traditions and I think this is from the, if I'm not mistaken, this is from the Bow Bunny collection, uh, Christmas collection. So, yeah, I added that in. So, she, if she wanted, she could just add in, like, a little uh, photo on here or something, some kind of memories and stuff. And then on the top corners of this box, I did add some filigree, some um, photo corner filigrees. That's actually from Wild Orchid Crafts as well. And I ordered, I, I ordered, sorry. I actually put one on each corner of the top part. On each corner, so to give it that more like a like a more luxurious Christmas feel to its sparkle. So yeah, I added that. And then at the bottom part, what I did is that I couldn't find nothing to put as little legs. So what I did is I found at this my local craft store, I I found these little corkscrews. And what I did is that I just um 
I painted them white and then I just painted them with a, a regular acrylic gold paint so they could stand out. Yeah, so it could make the, the box really stand up and stuff instead of laying flat like they usually um, do. So yeah guys, this is my little um, altered box, cigar box that I made for my partner Mimi. I hope she likes it. I'll be sending it out for her today. And I just wanted to make a video to share with you guys this uh, beautiful box and thanks for watching. Have a nice day.